if you are interested in astronomy cosmology stars etc then you must have heard about solar mass so let's find it out solar mass is a unit of mass solar mass is used to measure the masses of celestial objects like black holes stars galaxies clusters etc solar mass is defined as the mass of sun in simple sentence sun's mass is called one solar mass one solar mass is approximately equal to 2 into 10 to 30 kg we use solar mass to express the mass of celestial objects because if the mass of celestial objects are expressed in kilograms then it becomes difficult to remember for example the mass of brightest star sirius is 4.01778 kilograms and in solar mass it is 2.02 solar mass hence it is better to express the mass of celestial objects in solar mass. derivation since earth is performing a circular motion around the sun therefore centripetal force is provided by the gravitational force f centripetal is equals to f gravitational gmm upon r square is equals to mv square upon r where capital m is mass of sun small m is mass of earth r is distance of earth from the sun g is gravitational constant by rearranging the equation we get capital m is equals to v square into r upon g since r travel a distance of 2 pi r in time period t then velocity is given by v is equals to 2 pi r upon t substituting the value of v we get m is equals to 4 pi square r cube upon z t square We know Earth takes 365.25 days to complete one revolution around the sun. Therefore, time period t is equals to 365.24 into 24 into 60 into 60 seconds. The distance of Earth from sun is 1.5 into 10 raised to 11 meters. Substituting the values of t, r, g, and pi. we get m is equals to 2 into 10 to 30 kg